Okay, all right, we're back. We're back. Yes, we are. So, this episode we are going to bring us full forward and go in wall five. Okay. And, and at the end of the each episode of my Let's Play, I'm going to do a comment, uh, a question. Like I said in the last episode. I get it. So it's at the end of each episode. You stupid walk! Come with so me. So our walk. questions in the last episode had to do, well, yours had to do with something called Mario Super Road. Star Road. I know, Star Road. Have uh, you ever played Super Mario Star Road? No. I think they should create a. Uh, Super Mario Asteroids game. Combine okay. those together. Okay. I know you don't really remember Asteroids, but when I first started playing video games in arcades and sub shops and, and, and pizza shops and like that, way back in the early 80s, okay, they used to have a video game you could play called Asteroids. I loved playing that game. Well, I think maybe they should combine the two. Yeah. Why not? I made you know, the Mario lava. I made the lava yeah. and I'm not dying. You know Mario existed back then too, right? Yeah. And if and, I remember and right, it was like Donkey Kong. Yeah, I remember right. Arcade it was, game. Yeah, arcade game. If I remember right. How did I survive? Kato doesn't care. He hates it when I talk flashbacks to the eighties. Oh that's okay. That's okay? Yeah. All right. I think that they have like uh, Mario. Yes! They have Mario versus Sonic, right? Some games involving Mario versus Sonic. Uh, Mario and Sonic at at the end and and uh, so ah. You think they'll ever have Mario versus Pac-Man? Um, I think they might not. They might not. You know, in Pac-Man, they had a bunch of different ones. There was Pac-Man, and there was Pac-Man 2, there was uh, Mrs. Pac-Man, and then they had one, a baby Pac-Man as well. Not sure if you were aware of that. Um, I'm not aware and of course, that. you know, there's been plenty of other Pac-Man games since then, but I'm talking about when, when, when I used to waste quarters at the arcades. Oh, and, and, and actually, at, at, at the end of the episode, I'm going to ask a question, which, which, which will actually be a little crazy, but it's a bit mario -ish because it has Mario Pipes. Mario Pipes. So long, walk! Okay. Alright, so uh, we were talking about what? Nutrition for breakfast. Yeah. And um, how about spaghetti? Would that be considered a nutritional breakfast? Have you yeah. ever woken up the next day and said, Oh man, I'm too tired to make breakfast. You open up the fridge and you see like cold spaghetti in there and you realize... Oh man, that sounds good. Oh yeah, I forgot. <laughs> and I and I forgot the stamp because I can't get it. Or you open up the fridge and you you see a piece of chocolate cake. Oh yeah. And you realize, you know, chocolate cake. Well, they put eggs in there, right? Yeah. I'm ripping off Bill Cosby right now. That's a Bill Cosby routine. You don't know who Bill Cosby is, do you? No. Amazing. But at least I can get the stamp now. No! Oh, I almost didn't, didn't make it. So let's jump on! So, you don't know Bill Cosby, but you know who Ariana Grande is, though, right? Yeah. See? See, but she's so much better, isn't she? 
Yeah. Yeah. And she rocks. Yeah. Yeah. She, she, she was in two shows. She's been in two shows. You're right. Yeah. Victorious. Yeah. Wait, no. Three shows, actually. Three shows. One, one is in iCarly. She was in iCarly. Oh, you mean when they had the iCarly and Victorious yeah. meet up at that party? Yeah. I party with Victorious, I think it was called. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, Kato gets me to watch all these shows. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, well, maybe someday they'll have Bill Cosby on. <laughs> oh, and I'm scared right now. Because I'm small. You know, it was really funny. I told Kato one time when we were, that show first came on, Sam and Cat. I said, after a few episodes, he made me watch it. I said, you know what, Kato? This kind of reminds me of some weird no! kid, of a weird kid's version of Laverne and Shirley. And he was like, what? I said, yeah, it kind of reminds me of a weird. And Laverne and Shirley was a TV show from the 70s. Okay. Right? And so wouldn't you know it, they eventually have the two actresses on from Laverne and Shirley do guest do guest appearances on the Sam and Cat show. Yeah. So like obviously Freddy. I wasn't the only one who like thought that. Like Freddy. For my colleagues. Yeah, well Freddy, yeah, yeah, yeah. He, he still has no idea what I'm talking about, folks. Yeah. But for us older dads that have to sit and watch these shows with our kids. It's kind of good to know that they they throw in some uh, they throw in some of the older TV stars and and, make reference and, to it. And, and of course Sam is in it. Right? Yeah, right. Well, the guy that created the show, Kato, he used to be an actor. He used to be an actor. He was on an 80s sitcom. Sitcom is a situational comedy. It's kind of like, let's see if you know any sitcoms today. But you know, like The Big Bang Theory is a sitcom. 30 minutes. You sit, you watch, and you laugh. Okay? Well, the guy that created Sam and Cat, some of all those other shows, he was on one in the 80s called Head of the Class. Maybe I should have you watch that. Okay. And, and, and if, if you've seen Super Psycho of Sam and Cat, that, um, Neville was in it? Yeah, Neville. Gibby? Yeah. And Nora. Nora. And they all come from iCarly, right? Yeah. Yeah. All three of them. See you later! And I'm just gonna waste my cat power. Okay. Because why not? Uh, I guess we'll look on... We'll, we'll talk about something else. Okay. Yeah. So, we have another question for this episode? Um, we are still waiting. We're for, waiting for a question. Yeah, for the very end of the episode. So, let's just get out of this level. Because it took a long time. Oh, here's a question. How about this? Instead of sh shoelaces on your shoes, have you ever laced your sneakers or your shoes with spaghetti? <laughs> alright, alright, let's ask our question. You think you can tie now. your shoe with spaghetti? Let's 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 ask our question now. Alright, alright. If 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 you ever played Super Mario Star World, me and I did I play Super have I ever played Super Mario Star World? No. Have you? No, of course I haven't. Be because I just told a 
of it like a month ago. You heard about it a month ago. Yeah. And how old is the video game though? Um, about three months old. Three months old? Yeah. What system? Um, computer. Com oh, it's on the computer. Yeah. Okay. Um, and and I'm going and and you. What what was your last um, question for the episode? Last episode. The last episode was is uh, pizza considered a nutritional breakfast? Uh, maybe. Maybe. All maybe right. not. All right. All right. Maybe. All maybe right. not. All right. For, I know right. it's a good for, breakfast when you for, have nothing else to eat. For the question of of this episode for me, have of course uh, it's going to be a video game or a different game. Have you ever played? Wait, do do you like two D games or three D games? Me? No, no. This. This is the question. Oh, the question. Answer. Do you like 2D games or 3D games? Yeah, so so what is your question for this Oh, episode? what's my question? Yeah. Um, hmm. Is it possible to stick a worm up your nose and see if it comes out the other side? <laughs> All right. Leave, leave your questions down below. You know below. what, folks? Actually, I'll just answer it right now. It is not possible. Do not do it. Yeah. Okay, we the worm is going to end up in a place that you don't want it to be. Trust me. But you know what? When I was in my first year yeah. of university years ago, yeah. I had a roommate that tried that. He's tried to stick a worm up his nose <laughs> to see if it would come out the other side. And no, it didn't. Where did it end up? Actually, it ends up... Uh, you know, it ended up down his throat. <laughs> All right, I'll and, explain that to you and, when we're not doing this Let's Play, because that's a long explanation. All right. And, and actually, in first grade, my, my teacher, Miss Tui, actually went and read a book, book which, which, which is some guy eat, eating worms. Eating worms. <laughs> Why do I remember a story about that when I was in grade school? I have to think about that. Yeah, be. You just guys gave me a flashback. All right, see you guys next time. See you guys next time. We're in the stamp. <laughs>